This is good. We're honored to be joined today by Shanna Gray, who owns a vegan restaurant. It's supposed to be really good. I have, I'm not into the vegan stuff, I must say, but I'm going to have to try this. <laughs> when, I, when we come here in a short period of time into Milwaukee, we're going to come and try that vegan food. I don't know if I'm going to like it. But she had a big business. Shanna says her business is being brutalized by the soaring cost of food. She's never seen anything like it. And right now, she says, things just aren't working. She was doing great. Three and a half years ago, she was doing better than she ever did. During the Trump years, she said, I was able to afford things. I wasn't worried about my future. I am now. I'm starting to really worry. The stress and the anxiety are really hurting me. So I'd like to have Shanna come up for a second and say a few words. Thank you. Beautiful. That's nice. As we spoke before, um, it is very important that we change what is going on now. None of us can continue to go with the Biden administration. We definitely need to make this house party over. We need Trump in 2024, so make sure you vote Trump 2024. Amen. Trump 2024. Thank you. Now please listen to the same lady basically explaining why Donald Trump is the best choice. Why now, how was it operating your restaurant during the Trump years? Uh, during the Trump years, I, I pretty much started my business around that time. Mm-hmm. I would say things were substantially different, meaning really? I was able to, I was working as well, mm-hmm. but I was able to afford things. I wasn't worried about my future as I am now. Um, I, the, my food cost was so much lower at that time. Not saying that was, that's, that's a better. That's the only issue. Yeah, but, but it was, that's a things good issue. were very much so different. What? Meaning I didn't have the stress or the anxiety about tomorrow, you wow. know, just from eating and, you know, supporting myself. Mm-hmm. So. If you could tell the president of the United States, Joe Biden, one thing right now. Sleepy he was Joe. Like standing right in front of you. <laughs> what would you tell him? Um, I would ask if you can pretty much look at the people and what's currently going on right now and how we are all pretty much we're suffering and we need help. Um, yep. I'm not really sure what could be done at this point, but it's definitely not going in the right direction for myself personally, as well as business owners like myself. Um, it's, it's not looking good right now. Santa, thanks so much. I mean, this is common sense. During the Trump presidency, she was able to afford things like food. She wasn't worried about her future. There was no stress or anxiety about tomorrow. And guess what? I'm pretty sure millions of Americans can relate to this lady. Those are great reasons to vote for Donald Trump. And with what's happening right now in this country, with the economy, inflation, the crisis at the border, crime, and now these new protests happening at college and university, it has to stop. We need law and order, bro, and somebody who can fix the economy, like a businessman, not a career politician, who's been there for over 50 years, still making promises and falling all over the place. Come on, man. You let me know what you think about this in the comment section. God bless this lady. God bless you and your family. Catch you on the next one. Trump 2024.